I never thought it would happen in my lifetime, but I am so glad I am alive to see this happen. Sharon Freeman says she'll be glued to the TV on Wednesday. And I'll be watching, just waiting. I'm not going to miss a minute. I'm going to see it all. She'll be watching as Kamala Harris officially becomes the first black and the first Asian American vice president. She's also watching to see a fellow member of Alpha Kappa Alpha Sorority Incorporated make history. It means so much. I am just so proud. Freeman is the president of the Alpha Kappa Alpha's Tacoma chapter. The organization is the country's first black sorority, a foundation of support and personal development that Harris is not shy to talk about. She tweeted this picture just days ago on the organization's 113th anniversary. I would imagine um, there's many who feel just like I do, um, a sense of pride. Monica Brown is vice president of the organization's Seattle chapter. I think the attention that we're now seeing and realizing as a result of Kamala Harris and stepping into this new position as vice president is bringing more um, curiosity and awareness of the work that we have been doing and will continue to do in our communities. Although ceremonial festivities are different this year, Freeman says she's imagining what the moment would have looked like in person. If we hadn't had COVID, that mall, in addition to the flags, red, white, and blue, would have been pink and green. As Kamala Harris is officially sworn in as the vice president, what are you going to be thinking? Well, after I have donned my pink and green, I am going to be thinking that anything is possible. Britt Moore, King 5 News.